the customers, it's not every parent for every student or every player is going to buy one of these cameras. The team might or the league might or the organization might. And then the the users are all going to have their app and they'll pull their footage, right? So not everybody buys a camera. Do you just like send it a picture of your kid and it's like, all right, there's a reel with just Timmy in it? Yeah, basically, that's how you can do it. (laughs) That's the goal, basically. You you don't yeah, yeah you don't need the pics of your Screw neighbor. Stacy, we don't want to see her. Just Timmy, <laughs> right. Timmy, and all the shots. <laughs> so there's or Timmy's those are, face on the other kids. <laughs> those are different customers, though, right? Like the the organization leader, and then the experience for that parent uh, is different than maybe say the high school player who he's handling his own business because he's 17, he has a phone, whatever. Um, and so we we try to understand that, and not make any preconceived assumptions, I guess. Uh, and then two, everything about it, the life cycle of the product. So maybe a service technician at their company or in the case of an autonomous vehicle, maybe whatever their service situation is or the upfitter, the builder of it, they're a customer of your work at some point. You put something together and then you handed it off and they have to do their job. They have to do their step in the process based on what you gave them. You need to understand that to a certain extent. Yeah, it makes sense. Yep. I mean, 